Good afternoon. Back with another season here. Figging. We got the birds chirping. We got the figs squirting. And we got another year for production. But now with this nice warm weather coming through, let's not get too excited. Okay, let's not get too excited now and start uncovering our trees and digging up the trees that we buried for the winter time. If you're in a 6A, 6B zone like I'm in, in Connecticut, look, we still got some cold weather to go through. Okay, we, next week could be 30 degrees and then 15 at night. So I'm not going to jump the gun, but I am going to take my smaller fig trees out to wake them up early and I'm going to put them inside my mudroom greenhouse over here at night so the soil conditions can stay warm because that's key with these once they get their metabolism going this is what you want to do you want to keep it warm so that that production can keep happening now if you do decide to uncover your tree and you dig up your tree and you bring it outside and 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 the figs and the leaves are growing if we get a cold front that comes through and it's 15 degrees at night whatever growth you have that it's going to be dead it's going to be gone and don't jump it a couple more weeks okay guys and um, I'm my educated guess when I will uncover my tree and dig up the, the rest of my trees I'm guessing around April 1st from the the um, research I've done on the long-range forecast it shows promising results after April 1st where daytime highs will be in the 60s and then at night they're gonna be like 35 36 that's ideal that's where you want it to be at okay you don't want anything below 32 degrees at night it's risky risky business um, but other than that you know winter was cold around here it was cold it was cold and you know I'm excited to, to unwrap my big fig tree because that beast is gonna be a massive producer this year and number two I can't wait to open it up and show all you people out there that the cement, insulated cement wrap works 100% of the time, 100% of the time. And I'm very excited that I actually went back and did that because the, the cold weather we had this year, when I did the burlap and then the, the, the heavy duty tarp on top, it would have never survived. The top part would have never survived. No doubt, would not have. So I'm happy I went back and, and put that insulated wrap on there. And um, I know that I'm gonna have a monster this year, so. I'm excited for that. But other than that, I don't want to eat any more of your time. Have a good day, and I'll see you in the future.